Hello beautiful people and welcome back to our channel. My name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment as well as messages on my Instagram. And if you are wondering why is that, because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to spy on your competitors TikTok ads for free. And yes, actually you can do that. You can spy on your competitors TikTok ads for every niche or any product or category that you are working for and spy on them and what I mean by spy on them figure out if their ads is actually successful or not and this is a really unique trick and I don't think you can find any video with this information so far and also as I said the trick that we'll be using in this video is completely free without using any paid tools or anything like that so if this video helped you out help me out pressing that like button I would really appreciate it and not just that I will actually do demonstration on finding competitors so if in your case you don't know your competitor or you're just in a research phrase so you're trying to figure out which niche or which category or product you should go for in this video I would do demonstration by finding a specific niche or going for a specific niche and I would do demonstration on that on some ad on that niche to figure out if it's actually winning for the advertiser or not and that should give you an idea on how to find your competitors and as I said spy on them and figure out if their ads are successful or not and without any more talking let's just jump to it so i'm going to access tiktok creative center so just hit over to the description box or search on it just like i'm doing right now creative center for any case if you didn't find it on google search engine just scroll down the description i will put the link for it in there and also they just released the top products right here which is a really good tool to find the uh, top performing products on their platform which is the ads platform not the organic tiktok and that's really good and they give some really good information and i did make actually a video on it and they did explain each feature on it so if you are interested make sure to check out my channel that video will help you a lot and for this video we will use the top ads right here so head over to the top ads as you can see and right now as i said i'm going to find a niche and we will do demonstration on it so the first thing you, you would see once you access it obviously is the search bar and in here the option for selecting a country make sure to go for a country that you are working on uh, in my case i'm just doing demonstration i'm going to keep it as united states and from the industry option right here as you can see you can click on it and select the category or the niche that you are working on or the product that you are trying to find competitors to spy on their ads and from my experience i would recommend to do not use this option use the search query instead search for a product for example if you are doing something that has to do with uh, kitchen appliances and so on type in here kitchen it's far better than using the industry here because i think the data on this option is not accurate uh, i don't know it's from the tiktok creative centers and or from the advertisers and they select uh, a false uh, industry or category for the ad set in any case as i said make sure to use the keyword search instead of the category from here and the objective also i do recommend you to keep it like this do not select anything because we are going for a specific niche if you are doing finance and you're trying to find product that has to do with finance in that case you can select conversions because you will get a lot of uh, apps or applications that require a uh, up install objective for their ad set so in that case just to filter out all those go for conversion but i think very small people will go for that so let's just keep it like this and for the likes do not select anything uh, also on the duration here so as i said we will use the search query here to find competitors then we will find some ads that has to do with our niche and we will spy on them to figure out if their ad set are successful or not and as i said the trick that we show you in this video is really unique so just hold on you will really like it so right now let's just go i did go for an example i did say the example sorry about kitchen right so let's just go for kitchen i'm going to type in here kitchen and after that if we hit enter it will give you some uh, uh, recommendations here do not select anything just go broad right here kitchen it will give you 426 results and as i said this is just for the keyword kitchen in your case make sure to type in a keyword that has to do with your niche so if we scroll down right here as you can see there is a lot of ads that has to do with kitchen and almost all of them are products as you can see but how do we know which ones are the successful for the advertiser and they are making money for them so let's just scroll down to find some products in here for example i saw this one it looks like some uh, 
yeah this might be a good product let's just try this one so let's just do demonstration just right click open a new tab and it will give you some informations here the likes 150 and the comments and the four shares however this is really important data and if we look at this data from a different angle you can actually discover or tell if the ads is actually successful for the advertiser or not and we will get to that in a moment but first as you can see it will give you this option which is the reasons and this is where the countries this ad is running in as you can see 23 countries and from my experience when you see a lot of countries like this it might be a brand or it might be an advertiser that just uh, testing out the product because it's really hard to scale to all those countries at once so it's probably just testing and from here the industry they didn't get it right as you can see kitchen bathroom appliances and from the objective is conversions and lead generation and right now let's just get to the fun part which is how to tell if this ad is successful or not and as you can see i did not set up this ad or set up this video to show you the winnings ones or something like that i did go for it randomly in here so so the first thing we're going to check is the likes and the comments and the shares as you can see this one has 157 and likes and one comment and four shares however this info are just for the last seven days so let's just go for the last 30 days here okay it has more 250 likes and six comments and six shares and let's just go back to even 180 days and it did not actually increase by just a little bit and that's the downside of not scripting videos so this is a bad example in my case but what this information tells us basically this ad is not a winning one or is not successful for the advertiser because he's not scaling at all this is probably a brand or testing the product because from the last 180 days to this date right now it get only 284 likes and six comments and seven shares which is really low compared to a product that's targeting 23 countries as you can see so he's probably just testing out uh, turning off some some countries and turning on some other countries and targeting different interests and so on that's why the, the the engagements is really low on the product so he does not promote the products that strong or that well compared to the all the countries he is targeting so let's just get back and go for other products just to find a winning one so you can get more clear idea about the trick so for example this one right here it's running in three countries united states canada and united kingdom which is the top tier countries and in the last seven days it got 394 likes and four comments and 123 shares and if we get back to 30 days the last 30 days it increases by a lot as you can see 100 1189 and 18 comments and 362 shares which is a lot of shares compared to the comments you see so let's just get back to 180 days and oops it did not increase at all as you can see let's just show you that for a moment it did not increase and you might be wondering why is that because this ad has only started running in the last 30 days so when you get back to the last 180 80 days sorry it does not increase or the number of likes or comments or share does not change at all so the ad has only started in the last 30 days as you can see so if we get back to the seven days so in the last seven days it got 300 likes and the last 30 days it got 1189 likes so so as i said this will tell us and will give us an idea if the ad is actually successful or not right now i will try to find one that's completely different and it will give you a really good idea about my trick so let's just get back here so for example this product right here it's uh, the last seven days it has zero likes zero comments zero shares and the last 30 days as well zero likes zero comments zero shares and if we get back to the last 180 days it has 200 likes and two comments and 12 shares so this is actually tell us that this guy or this girl this brand was testing this product in three different countries for a uh, less than a week because this data is really low and it did not work for him 
this product did perform very badly so it did stop it more than a month ago because if we get back the last 30 days it got zero likes zero comments zero shares and in the last 180 days it got 200 likes so it did start the ad like more than uh, three months or four months ago and it did run it for a week and they did stop the ad so in the last 30 days that's why it got zero likes zero comments and zero shares and if you did find some product that if you go to the last 180 days it got a lot of likes and comments and shares and in the last seven days as well it got uh, likes and comments and shares that means that the product is actually winning for the advertiser that's why it started running more than uh, 180 days and still running to this day and get a likes and comments because who is gonna promote a product for more than uh, 180 days without making a profit it doesn't make sense right so that's what i mean by successfully spy on advertisements on tiktok and figure out if it's actually successful or not and if you have any questions and you didn't understand this idea correctly make sure to drop me a comment below i would be happy to reply to you with the information that you need and i do reply to each comment as well as messages on my instagram and if you are wondering why is that because simply i'm working for you Otherwise for this video, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.